What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today we're going to taste test Italian MRE Edwin Serkisian sent it to me a while back so I thought why not open it up and see what this thing is all about I think last time I put I think last time I taste tested Modular F this one is Modular G that was about 3 years ago or almost maybe even longer so anyways let's open it up see what's inside Boom. So this is like 24 hour Russian because you got it here breakfast, lunch and dinner. Hopefully it's also in English. Yep. This is breakfast. Very nice that it's in English. They said here lunch. And the last one. It's a supper. So we're gonna open up one thing at the time. I even forgot what it's all about. So unique. Biscuit. This is some kind of paper bag. Three paper bags. That's all it is. Okay, anyways. Napkins with a spoon. Oh wow, look at that. Toothbrushes. Three of them. I guess for the breakfast we get in for the rest of the day. I guess you brush your teeth after each time you eat. This is crazy. Wow. Salt. Toothpicks. What is that? Candy. Like um, gelatin candy. Like a jello type of candy, I guess. Like marmalade. Look at that. Camping stuff. Military camping stuff. Fills. Tablets. Three of them. Whoa, what is this? Full cream sweetened condensed milk. I can't believe they explain what it is. You know what? This thing reminds me of Russian MRE so much. Uh, chocolate, cacao, or coffee, instant coffee. Not really sure what it is. Some kind of tablets, sugar, and military matches. Non breaded pink tip. Very cool. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Now we got here fork, knife and spoon. Spoon broke off, but that's okay. Biscuits, more of them. Whoa, there's a lot of stuff. Whoa, what is that? Energy, some kind of gum or something. Sugar, coffee, more coffee. In a mix. Some kind of energy candy again. And this is our lunch. We're still not really sure what that means, but we'll find out in a minute. Toltenlini in ragu. Not really sure how to pronounce that or translate it. And the next one looks like we got here some kind of gem or something. We'll open up and find out what it is. So this is would be lunch. Obviously, I'm not gonna be eating much of this this is so much food but still really cool to show you guys but i will do a quick taste test biscuit sugars coffee i can't believe how much coffee we're getting this is the name of this one i wish there was a translation i don't think there is none tachino we'll just have to open it up and see what it is and power sport energy Lots of energy bars, that's for sure. Okay, first we'll unbox breakfast. Look at that huge condensed milk piece. Okay, what about crackers right here? Oh wow, look at that. It's almost pieces of bread. Kingi, chocolate. Oh, this chocolate have changed colors a little bit. It happens. Napkin, spoon. Wait, where is my actual food? I guess that's all you get for breakfast is condensed milk or something. And you got right here toothbrush, but this stuff you'll save for lunch and dinner as well. That's why you have those bags to put some of that stuff back in and save it, I guess. So yeah, that's all you get for the breakfast. I guess uh, 
condensed milk. What you do is open it up, flip it open, and looks like this is a cooked condensed milk. Usually it's white. This one is this kind of color. Instant coffee. And sugar. Very nice. Looks good. But you know what? You could also put some condensed milk in there, make it even sweeter. Whoops. It's a metal tube. There you go. That will work instead of the creamer. When I was a kid, I used to drink condensed milk with coffee and tea all the time. Quick taste test. Cracker is pretty nice. Oh yeah, coffee is amazing. Whenever you can add on so much condensed milk in, it has a lot of colors. That one tube probably has like a thousand colors. I wonder if it's gonna tell me. Of course not. But you know what, when you're in the military and running around in the field, you'll need every color. A super small breakfast. I mean, when I wake up, usually all I want is just coffee. But this is stayed up sweets. Yep, daylight, marmalade. Mmm, this is good. Well, guys, super tiny breakfast, as you can see, mostly sweets. Very unique, unexpected. Now let's stay out lunch. Oh no, this one got distorted a little bit. I think this one as well. Okay, let's see what this can is about. Oh, it's like a soup of some sort. Oh, there is another soup. Obviously, you probably would put it in a canteen, hopefully have metal canteen, and warm it up, or you can warm it up in a can as well. And this is what I thought, it's not jelly, but this is more like, uh, what do you call it? It's pretty much canned food, it's gonna be sweet. My taste buds a little bit messed up from all that sweets but whoa look at that this is a pieces of sausage inside of this soup mmm it's good what else is there that was fun you see guys this is literally those winners in a can I don't usually like them it does not taste like meat at all it tastes like paper it doesn't taste like anything I wonder what they made from this spoon is broken but this is like pieces of pasta looks like with meat maybe maybe not let's try out one mmm this stuff is good so you got here macaroni stuff pretty nice and the last one right here this is good sweet stuff look at that food Mm-hmm. I don't even know. There's a whole bunch of stuffs. Looks like it's completely mixed up with a lot of lot of stuff and This is just tastes like juice. I like it So that's what you would get for lunch completely opposite from the breakfast no sweets at all Actually, you do get a bunch of energy gums and stuff like that. That is weird I'm not gonna take it. Look at that this is actually looks like a peel definitely not taking it and what is this looks like energy vitamins type of deal definitely not taking it either okay let's get to the dinner now energy bar right here usually these things are pretty high color as well so I'll stick it in here then more crackers let's see if this one survived much better Nope. I had this MRE for a while, so it's okay. Got beat up a little bit. No wonder this MRE is so heavy. Okay, let's see what this stuff is about. Ooh, looks like kasha. Or grits. I don't know, this is looks like uh, some kind of grits with lots of meat. I see mushrooms. No, this is not mushrooms, olives. So it's some kind of Italian dish, obviously Italian food is amazing. But yeah, there you go, that looks 
very unique and delicious okay let's see what this stuff is about because it's all in a different language no way this is a cutleta a piece of meat okay this stuff i'm gonna put it into the tray look at that piece of meat right here so you guys can see what's happening here and this thing i'm gonna put in here look at that that looks delicious boom and of course dinner will be the biggest let's try it out with pieces of meat for some reason this is kind of sweet but it has meat and everything like that wow unique okay piece of meat whoa it has vegetables like carrots and stuff like that inside of this piece of meat but reminds me of like canned tuna or canned chicken so this is what reminds me of it it's pretty good i like it and the energy bar soft energy bar so i don't have to chew it really really hard but it does look like play-doh you know those energy bars but mm, pretty good what you would expect from energy bar just like an energy bar flavor like a little bit of chocolate kind of coffee flavor but yeah there you go guys this is what you would expect to get in 2016 italian mre it's pretty awesome maybe i should do a 2020 italian mre in the future in a few months because this is a much much older mre they don't usually go bad for four five years depends on mre so thumbs up for me for sure very unique italian mre does not mess around with teeth there's fully dental kit with toothbrushes every single time you, i guess you discard them that's amazing this is the most unique piece inside of this mre i would say everything else is pretty similar like it reminds me if anything like a russian mre because you got here similar heating packs and cans it's very very heavy mre so it's not that good compared to united states mre or many other ones they moving away from cans because it's much much lighter i i feel like even 2019 russian mre i seen that there was no cans and it was much lighter that's is awesome so hopefully i can find a new Italian MRE and see if they have upgraded as well and moved away from all the scans because this is probably one of the heaviest MREs I have put to the test. Anyways, let me know in comments below what do you think about this video. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.